What's going on guys, Retex Message here. Hope everyone well today got a brand new video for you guys. Today, we will be going over Gardevoir's moveset in Pokemon Unite. This is in English because this was from the Android beta back in March. I have screenshots of all the movesets for every single Pokemon. So, let's get right into it. The basic attack becomes a boosted attack with every third attack. When this boosted attack hits, it deals damage to opposing Pokemon in the area of effect and decreases their special defense for a short time. All these other Pokemon here that we've done so far, uh, their basic attacks were just basic attacks. There was nothing else to it, no other uh, effects or status effects, anything like that. This one for Gardevoir has some extra stuff going on. Becomes a boosted attack and a decrease in special defense. Super cool, honestly. I can't wait to play Gardevoir uh, sometime whenever uh, Pokemon Unite releases this month. And hopefully we actually uh, do get her sometime soon. For our first ability, we have Synchronize. When an opponent inflicts decreased movement speed or damage over time condition on the Pokemon, the same is inflicted on that opponent. This ability goes on cooldown after it's triggered. So it's something that you would use. And let's say you are slowed down for five seconds by another Pokemon. That Pokemon will then be slowed down for five seconds as well. Kind of cool, actually. I like that. For our Unite move, Fairy Singularity Hindrance. Warp space in the designated area, drawing an opposing Pokemon, shoves and deals damage to opposing Pokemon. The instant the warp space disappears. Honestly, I was a big fan of Gardevoir. I really was. I cannot wait, like I said, to use Gardevoir in game. Honestly, the effects as well and the gameplay that you guys are going to see tomorrow is going to be super sick. I cannot wait for you guys to see that. Alright guys, for our other abilities, we have Teleport, which is a dash. Has the user warp to a designated area, increasing the damage dealt by one basic attack after warping. Upon level 6, you could have Psy Shock or Future Sight. Psy Shock attacks three times in the front of the user. Upgrade also increases the damage this move deals each time one of its attacks hits. Future Sight sets a delayed explosion. When the explosion hits an opposing Pokemon, it shortens this move's cooldown. The upgrade resets this move's cooldown when it hits. I like Future Sight a lot more than Psy Shock. One of my favorites, honestly, for Gardevoir here. One million percent. No doubt about it. For our last ability here is Confusion Attack Straight in the Designated Direction. Nothing, you know, too, too crazy. But we do have Psychic and Moonblast upon level 8. Psychic, after hitting an opposing Pokemon or traveling its maximum distance, creates a circle that deals damage to opposing Pokemon in that area of effect, decreasing their movement speed for a short time. The upgrade reduces the cooldown. Moonblast has a user attack while moving back to create distance. When the move blast hits, it deals damage to opposing Pokemon in a cone and leaves the opposing Pokemon closest to the user unable to act for a short time. You can honestly go with either or, they're kind of similar in my opinion, so it's honestly up to you. But yeah guys, that's going to wrap up this video. If it was helpful, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and yeah, I'm out guys, have a wonderful day, peace.